everything that you need to know about your FOV. On maximum FOV, if you look at the ground, it seems like your game plays much faster. And if we go to minimum FOV, it makes it seem slower, even though we're going the same speed. On max FOV, we can see all six targets. Minimum FOV, you can only see two. On a minimum FOV, close range targets are going to be larger, but their movements are going to be faster, making close range combat a lot more chaotic and hard to keep up with. On maximum FOV, these same fights are going to be slowed down a lot more. You can see more around you, keeping you from getting tunnel vision. On max FOV, this target is extremely small. On a minimum FOV, it's much easier to see. However, on a minimum FOV, your sensitivity is going to feel faster. You'll see shakiness and errors in your aim more. And on top of that, recoil is going to feel a lot stronger. If we go on a max FOV, our sensitivity feels slower. And overall, recoil control feels better, even though it's the exact same recoil. It's just a trick on your eyes. On top of that, if you run 110 on an older console or a low-end PC, you may actually lose frames. That's why I recommend on older consoles and low-end PCs a 104 FOV and not going lower than a 90. On higher end PCs, I recommend a 104 up to a 110, as long as the 110 doesn't affect your mid and long range fights.